Hello, and welcome to UCC, home to a community of over 22,000 students. Did you know that nearly 4,000 of our students come from over 100 countries? Before we begin, this is a 360 degree campus experience, so be sure to have a good look around, all the way around. So here we are at the Western Road Ceremonial Gates, also known as the Main Gates. Originally established as Queen's College Cork in 1845, UCC has a stunning campus with the River Lee flowing through it. Set on 42 acres of wooded ground, you can still walk to Cork's vibrant city centre in just 15 minutes. In the top 2% of universities worldwide, UCC is recognised as the number one institution for student experience in Ireland. Our campus was the first university in the world to be awarded a green flag. In fact, the Global Green Campus Programme, which is active in 21 countries, is a movement that was started by UCC students over 10 years ago. We are outside the Glucksman Gallery, which is an award-winning museum and a landmark building that has been described as the best piece of new public architecture in Ireland for decades. Inside, you'll find bright and illuminating exhibition spaces, lecture facilities, a riverside restaurant and a gallery shop. From here, you can also see the lush lower grounds, which are home to many different species of trees from all over the world. In fact, UCC's green campus has over two and a half thousand trees and around 120 different species. The trees all around us have a very important natural and symbolic value. At UCC, we use the symbolism from acorn to mighty oak to represent the growth that arises from nurturing talent and enabling our students to reach their potential. We are standing in the middle of the Honan Square Plaza Amphitheatre, which is located in front of the Student Centre, or Orisnamach Lane in Irish, the Honan Chapel and the O'Rahilly Building. The Student Centre is where you will do your orientation and where you will meet your classmates for the first time. This is also where conferrings take place and where you officially become a UCC graduate. The wide walkway connects the amphitheatre to the two giant redwood trees located at the western end. You can learn more about these iconic giant redwoods on one of the frequent tours of the UCC tree collection which take place throughout the year. We are inside the Honan Chapel. Built in 1916 and dedicated to St Finbar, the patron saint of Cork, it is an exquisite example of revival Hiberno-Romanesque architecture. You can see that it has beautiful features, including the exotic mosaics of the tiled floor, depicting the zodiac and river of life, the intricate enamelled tabernacle and 19 radiant stained glass windows, 11 of which were made by the internationally renowned Harry Clark. It is an incredibly popular chapel for weddings, and such is the demand that only alumni and staff can get married here. We are here outside the O'Rahilly Building, also known as the ORB, which is home to the School of Languages, Literatures and Cultures, along with the Schools of English and Digital Humanities and Irish Learning, other academic departments and the administrative offices of the College of Arts, Celtic Studies and Social Sciences. The Departments of Management and Marketing, Food Business and Development, Business Information Systems and Accounting and Finance from the College of Business and Law are also located here. It is also the location of the UCC Language Centre, where you can take an English language class, as well as on Tunnel na Gael Galera, where you can take Irish language classes, if you want to learn or improve your Irish. We are located at the end of the Honan Plaza concourse, just in front of the two iconic giant redwood trees. UCC's tree collection is a phenomenal unique natural resource which we are incredibly lucky and privileged to have at our fingertips. Behind the giant redwoods stands the Bull Library, which was named after Professor George Bull. Bull was UCC's first professor of mathematics, and you may know him as the inventor of Boolean algebra. We are super proud that the father of the digital age is part of our rich history and heritage. A recent urban myth is that rubbing George's nose brings you good luck in your exams, so be sure to remember that when you're here. 
This is also the starting and finishing point for a number of short looped walks designed to help you keep active and fit in with your busy schedule. We are located in the middle of the quadrangle, more commonly referred to as the quad, which is situated at the heart of the main campus. Does it remind you of anywhere? Hogwarts from Harry Potter perhaps? Completed in 1849, this is the most iconic image of UCC and is an incredible example of Gothic style architecture. In the West Wing, you'll find lecture and tutorial rooms as well as the office of the Cork University Business School. In the North Wing, you'll find the Great Hall, known as the Aula Maxima, or Aula Max for short, as well as the Visitor Centre and other administrative offices. The East Wing was originally built as the private residence of the President, and today it is home to the offices of the President and Vice Presidents. A corridor or cloister walk, now called the Stone Corridor, links the West and North Wings. Are you superstitious? Then you won't want to cross the quad before graduation or even set foot on the grass, as you could fail your exams. You have been warned. Here on top of the clock tower in the quads, there are breathtaking views of our campus, our city and its hinterland. I'm afraid access to the clock tower is off limits, so be sure to take in the views while you can during this virtual experience. A number of UCC's academic units and buildings are located just outside or off main campus, with some dotted around the city and on the outskirts. Check out the arrows to find out which ones and where they are located. Cork is the largest and most southerly county of Ireland. It is a place of great wit and culture and has a proud tradition of independent thinking. If you like the great outdoors, Cork will not disappoint. It boasts some of Ireland's most magnificent landscapes and incredible natural amenities, including beaches on the Wild Atlantic Way, greenways, hill walking, river sports and much, much more. Cork is a hub of culture and business and is home to over 150 multinational companies. It is the perfect place to live, learn and have fun. We are here in the Stone Corridor, just outside UCC's Visitor Centre, which acts as a central point of information for visitors. Historical campus tours run from Monday to Saturday. Be sure to drop in and say hi to the team. The cloisters are home to UCC's unique collection of inscribed ohm stones, which illustrate an early alphabet. If you're a history buff, you'll be interested to know that these inscriptions date back to the mid-5th and late 7th centuries, and they're the earliest written source of the Irish language and the oldest recordings of personal names. We are here in the Aula Maxima, or Great Hall, which was constructed in 1847 and is located on the ground floor of the north wing of the Quadrangle. A large stained glass window at the east end of the hall features George Bull, the first professor of mathematics at UCC. Past presidents of the university are commemorated in oil portraits on the west wall of the hall. Originally, the ceremonial hall, the Aula Maxima, is now used for seminars, exams, research inductions, conferring receptions, weddings, banquets and concerts, such as the Fuam Concert Series. If you are a Harry Potter enthusiast, this is where the UCC Harry Potter Society's sorting ceremony takes place. We are here outside the new hub building. The hub, or on Mull in Irish, brings together a whole range of student services in a new state-of-the-art, technology-rich, fully accessible and sustainable learning and creative space. Here, you'll also find the award-winning UCC 98.3 FM, Ireland's only 24-7 student radio station, which has been broadcasting to students and the wider community since 1995. The new Calm Zone, or on Counter Cune in Irish, is an autism-friendly space that includes sensory and respite rooms, as well as an eating area and an open calm space to take some time out. We're here in the atrium space of the new hub building. Multiple student services are located in the hub and are here to help you transition into, through and out of college. 
On the ground floor, you'll find the UCC Campus Radio, 98.3 FM, the Makerspace, the Hub Reception Desk, Student Central, the Active Learning Zone, Careers Advisors, the Student Newsroom, and the offices of the First Year Experience Coordinator, Scholarships, and the Quirkus Talented Students Programme. The Office of the Director of Student Experience is also located on the ground floor. Did I mention that UCC is first for student experience in Ireland? Student Central is the initial point of contact for any queries relating to academic administration or if you want to get a form stamped or a letter of attendance. You can also get great coffee and service with a smile at Roots Cafe. On the first floor, you will find the Global Lounge, which is a really chilled community space to hang out with friends. You'll also find the Steps Auditorium study rooms and the mature students office, clubs and societies, the disability support service, UCC+, peer support, the student assistance fund and budgetary advisor and the student wellbeing coordinator. On the second floor you will find the work placement and employability and employer engagement divisions of career services, all here to help you get where you want to go. We are outside the Western Gateway Building, which along with the Brookfield Health Sciences Complex makes up the Western Campus. Students of Computer Science, Mathematical Sciences and Biochemistry from the College of Science, Engineering and Food Science are based here. And if you choose to study Public Health, Pharmacology, Anatomy, Neuroscience or Physiology, this is where you'll spend a lot of your day. If you have an entrepreneurial spirit, you'll be interested to know that UCC's amazing Ignite Graduate Business Innovation Centre for third level graduates is situated here. The UCC alumni and development office staff are based here too. From here you can also see the Victoria Mills, one of the student apartment complexes that are located within very short walking distance of campus. Our accommodation and community life office will be able to give you expert advice and support on all the accommodation choices available to ensure you find the option that is best for you. We are outside the main entrance to the Brookfield Health Sciences Complex, which houses three out of the six schools in the College of Medicine and Health, Medicine, Clinical Therapies and Nursing and Midwifery. The School of Pharmacy building is located just five minutes walk away on College Road. Complete with lecture theatres, clinical skills and simulation labs, computer labs and a restaurant, this is also where you'll find the Boston Scientific Health Sciences Library. The UCC creche is located right next door and is open to both students and staff of UCC. We are here in the Maradike Arena, which has been home to UCC sport and club activities since 1911. It comprises of 17 acres and UCC also has 52 acres of additional sports facilities at Curraheen, known as the farm, where many team sports take place. If you like going to the gym before or after class, check out this amazing state-of-the-art facility which includes fitness and weight gyms, saunas and steam rooms, three sports halls, a 25-metre swimming pool, two squash courts, a climbing wall, aerobics and dance studios, and rehabilitation clinic and the UCC Performance Laboratory. The outdoor grounds consist of an athletics track, a GAA pitch, a rugby and soccer pitch with spectator stand, and a water-based synthetic pitch for hockey and many other multi-sport use. Full-time registered students are automatically enrolled as members and with over 50 clubs, there are loads of options for you to choose from. We are here outside the International and the Adult Continuing Education Offices. The International Office is located in the Rose Lee Building and if you apply from outside the EU for an undergraduate or postgraduate programme, the staff here will be your primary points of contact. The International Office also coordinate the Erasmus Exchange and visiting students programmes. Adult Continuing Education is located in the Laurels Building and they provide opportunities in lifelong learning for all adults. The oldest student is over 100 years of age, which goes to show that your age is only a number when it comes to learning.
Here we are in the lower grounds. You can see the back of the quadrangle building majestically poised above the River Lee. The new Cavanagh Bridge is one of several UCC bridges that span the River Lee. Fun fact, in Cork City there are over 30 bridges. In the summer months you will see that these fabulous lower grounds are awash with colour from the wildflower meadow which is so important for our Irish pollinators. The wildflower meadow, our biodiversity action plan, our beehives, our single use plastic free bio cafe, our green library and our multiple green flag awards show just how committed we are as a community to embedding and integrating sustainability into who we are and what we do. We hope you've enjoyed this virtual experience of UCC. Please visit our website to connect with us and to get more of a feel of what it's like to live and learn at Ireland's leading student experience institution. We look forward to meeting you and to supporting you on your journey to begin, belong and become. Welcome to UCC. Welcome to the next chapter in your story.